hey, there you are. I've been waiting for you. Hey, I'm just saying, I'll wait for as long as I need if it means you'll come back to me. <laughs> what? Not flattered? It's only been two weeks, you know. That's not a long time. It's really not. What are you standing around for? Hurry up and sit down. Thank you. Here. Your favorite. I bought it just for you, you know. I think... I think we broke up on a misunderstanding. And I think you know that too. Or else, why would you have agreed to meet me? And at such a late hour, you know. People are going to talk. More so about you than about me, but they'll be talking nonetheless. Hey, I said I was sorry, but... I think it was all just a big misunderstanding. Listen, I'm not Little Miss Goody Two-Shoes or whatever. All right. That's not me. You know that's not me. And I don't think you want me to be that either. As a matter of fact, I know you don't want me to be like that. You don't like it when girls do everything you say. You don't like it when there's not a bit of a fight to it. You want that pushback. You want to argue. You just don't like it when things are easy. Or better yet, actually, I think that you like to be told what to do. It doesn't matter how many of those nice little girls you mess around with. You're not going to find anyone like me. <laughs> Please. There's no one that'll do you like I'll do you. You know that. I know you like me. You know you like me. There's no reason to push me aside just because of some little misunderstanding. Yeah, I've slept with a lot of people. So what? I wasn't cheating on you. I'm not that low. Okay? I am not drunk. The wine makes me think better. And you should have some of yours, too. Listen, okay? I miss you. A lot. Like, a lot, a lot. I like being with you. I'm just a bit of a high-maintenance girl. But you like that. You like how I look, and you especially like how I feel and how I smell. Those things don't come cheap. All right? Listen. I make plenty of money doing what I do. The real problem is you, not me. You need to trust me and to relax and to let me do my thing. Why don't you sit a little bit closer to me? <laughs> I insist, come here. You always were so handsome, you know. It was your hair that really caught my eye. But it's everything about you. How you carry yourself, how you walk, how you talk. You talk real big. Real big. In some ways, you can back it up, but in others, well, you're just bluffing. 
No, baby. Baby, please. I'm not insulting you. I'm just telling you what you need to hear. Listen. We're going to get back together. Whether that's tonight or in three months when you break up with the next girl because you get bored of her. You're going to come crawling back to me. That's how this always goes with people like you. And why wouldn't you? I can buy you things, take care of you. I've got a pretty flexible schedule, too. You're going to get bored of those girls that act all shy and that do whatever you say. You need someone like me who can put you in your place. Hey, I know you feel the same way because if you didn't, you wouldn't have shown up when I texted you. So why prolong the inevitable? Yeah, I take up a lot of your time. I'm your girlfriend. Of course, you'll be spending more time with me than with anyone else. And yeah, we already established them. I'm a high maintenance girl. We're going to be spending a lot of time together. You're not going to have as much time to be hanging out with other people. That's how this goes. Of course, it's a good thing. Don't you like spending time with me? Didn't you enjoy spending time with me? I was your girlfriend. Of course you did. It's what I'm here for. And besides, whenever we're alone, you know that we have tons of fun together. And I like playing with you. You're way more interesting than my last toy. Okay. I can work with that. But you don't have to restrain yourself, you know. A trial period, really? All it takes is one more night, and you're going to forget why we ever even argued in the first place. I'm not controlling. I just know what I want and I take what I want and what I want is you. I want you to be mine. I don't want to see you with any other girl. You don't want to be with any other girl. Listen, when you're with me, you don't have to worry about anything. You don't have to worry about money or rent or your job. All you have to do is sit there and be pretty. And I think that's something you could do pretty easily. I'm a little demanding, sure, but it's nothing you can't keep up with. You'll learn. You'll relearn. I have plenty of ways to keep you satisfied. You just need to learn to let go of control and give it to me. Don't you trust me, babe? I know what I'm talking about, and I know how to make you happy. Listen. I know it's scary, giving away your agency like that, but you've got to trust that I know what's best for you, because I do. You need to trust that I'm going to make the right decisions for you, because I will. Everything I've ever done was to support you. It might not always look that way from the outside, but from the inside... Why would I mistreat one of my toys? You're mine. Come on. 
toy doesn't mean anything bad. It just means that I like to play with you. I am serious. I've never been this serious about a person before. You think I'm the person that reaches out to other people to try and get them back? No. People chase me. You'd be a fool to let me go. So how about this? We leave this dingy bar. Then I'll drive us back to my place. You always liked it. It is up on what, 45th floor, floor to ceiling windows, view of the entire city. All of that and more will be yours one day. That entire penthouse, me, you, together. You just need to trust me to make it happen. I don't need you questioning me. I need you to listen. You had fun when we were together, didn't you? I did. I had so much fun. We can keep those good times rolling. Now, come on. I want to get out of here. So won't you let your girlfriend take you back to her place? <laughs> now that's what I like to hear. I'll let you drive my Porsche this time if you want. Also, you know I prefer to be the one driving. I am better at it than you. But if you stick with me, who knows? I could give you a few pointers. I've missed you these past two weeks. It'll be nice to sleep together again. Because I want you. Like, carnally. There isn't a person on this earth that I long for the way I long for you. It's animalistic. It's in my nature. I need to be one with you. I can't, I can't take being separate. I need us to be together. All I want is for you to be in my arms. That's all I need to survive. I don't need water or food. I need you and your soul. I need it to be with me. No matter what happens. Everyone else can go fuck themselves. I need you. <laughs> Are you shy? Can't believe I said that in public. It's not like anyone's listening to us anyways. But it's true. I love you. I love you in a way you couldn't possibly understand. You couldn't. I don't think I could put it into words. So what we're going to do is we're going to get back together. And we are going back to my place with my king-size bed and my silk sheets. We are going to have the night of our lives... And then you are going to tell that girl you've been texting that it's over. All right? <laughs> now, let's hurry up to the car. The longer we wait, the longer I think I won't be able to wait till we get back to the penthouse. <laughs>